really not like any race I've ever been in before. Um, the hardest part was at the beginning when there was so much mud and there was so much water that you just couldn't see anything, anything until you were right on top of it. So you'd come up to a jump and you'd have to sort of play it by ear each time and not hit other cars and not run off the course. We had 14 tire offs on the goggles at the start of the race and lost all of them in the first 20 minutes or so. So I was trying to keep that last tire off so I didn't get pulled off the track and uh, just conserving Terras, conserving vision, and going a lot slower when you needed to. This morning when we looked out the window, we knew what the conditions were probably gonna be like, and we didn't think that we were gonna race. So the fact that they were able to pull together a race for us today, that's, we're, we're very thankful for that. We were able to make it happen. We had an endurance. We had more runs than we were able to do on a dynamic day yesterday. Thanks to all of my volunteers. Thanks to all of our sponsors, because without the sponsors, without the volunteers, this doesn't happen, and in my opinion, this is Engineering Olympics, and if we're not doing it, I mean, this is our future out here, is all these students, so just thank you.